What's up guys and welcome again to the complete Kotlin course. In this video, we are going to talk about three types, any, unit, and nothing. These words, these keywords, we, uh, they are sometimes useful in Kotlin and we are not going to use them uh, basically or, uh, or every time and frequently, but we should know about them because maybe you will encounter them inside your uh, during your process of coding so the any type can be thought thought of as the mother of all other types except nullable types every type in kotlin whether an integer or string is also considered as any so any see guys this in this cut in Kotlin, this is uh, covering or including the the string, the end uh, string, or anything except the nullable type. So every every type in Kotlin except now okay except no okay so this is like the object type in java which is the root of all types except the primitives for example it's perfectly valid kotlin to declare an int literally and string literally as this so using uh, as any like so so i will create val any number this is called any number and instead of using int i can specify any so it is 42 and i will create a new constant val or you can use var but I will use val any string. I will name it as any string and I will give it the any type. And here it directly understand that the data type of any string would be a string. So any here refers to a string and any here refers to an integer. Okay, this is very simple. But we are not going to write like this because this is not a professional. Uh, we use the type interface to, to directly use the val and the constant in declaration. Okay, so this is how we use the any. Okay, we should understand it. Now, in order to use unit, there is a type called, special type called unit so unit is a special type which only ever represent one value the unit object which is deferring the one unit object or unit object okay this is very important it is similar to void it is equal to void similar to void in java except it makes working with genetics easier Every function which does not explicitly return a type, a string returns a unit. So anything that does not return uh, uh, like uh, data types, strings, or integer, it returns unit. For example, I will create a function. Later on, we will, we will learn about the functions. So, but till now, understand this, add here, and I will create a val a result equal to two plus five and print ln result. This function simply adds two plus two uh, or two plus five and prints the result, but does not actually return anything, not returning anything guys it's just printing so the return type 
unit is implied so the above function or this function would be the same as writing like this okay so unit refers as a void in java so unit is equal to unit the void in java so this function you can write this function without putting anything and this will just print the result and for demonstration for using the unit keyword or unit type it is not returning anything this type correspond to the void type in java okay this is how to use the unit now nothing type nothing is a type that is helpful for declaring that function not only does not return anything but also never completes so not a function is never completes what does this mean this is this can occur is if the function either causes the program to stop completely by throwing an exception or if if it simply goes uh, on forever without ever finishing how to do that or what is the example or what does this means i will create a function here do uh, and, and nothing for do nothing and if i specify nothing here this is the keyword it will make i will create a while loop true don't make anything inside this while loop okay you can cover while loops more in the next chapter we will cover them in the next chapter by the basic control flow but for now understand that this function will simply run forever without ever returning anything so welcome to the land of nothing it is just telling us that this will not make anything and this function will not make anything and it will not return anything so nothing it is a function that re that it is return nothing do nothing okay so this is the data type th this is the returning types or types in uh, kotlin that should we uh, that we should know any unit and nothing so we will not use them frequently but we should know about them